firefighter down, division two. Hey guys, we got a guy, a firefighter on engine five down. These firefighters are glowing in the dark for good reason. They are testing new firefighter safety equipment and products designed to improve visual accountability that help them reach victims faster. <laughs> These products use advanced photoluminescent technology that makes them glow. Photoluminescent crystals is a crystal that could absorb light energy. The crystals itself stores that energy and releases the light slowly back out. More than a dozen firefighters gathered recently at a training center in Anaheim to gather data on the benefits of photoluminescent products in dangerous situations. This is the first test of its kind to determine scientifically how photoluminescence improves safety for first responders. Teams tested two scenarios, a victim rescue and an injured firefighter rescue. How you feeling, buddy? <laughs> These tests were done with and without photoluminescent technology. One of the most dangerous aspects of a rescue is limited or zero visibility conditions that happen in smoky environments. In fact, firefighters often experience significant disorientation and accountability hazards when they lose sight of each other. Well, it's a complete loss of direction due to the lack of vision in a structure fire. Not only does it affect firefighters, but it also affects citizens trying to get out of a structure. All right, show up at the head, one at the feet. Ready? Ready? Go! In this situation, I had a company of three additional firefighters. Just a quick visual, I was able to uh, keep track of my members, uh, so the accountability was there. And then I was able to navigate a uh, stairwell. I'm not very familiar with this uh, training tower that we're here today, and because of the photoluminescence that's been placed, it sped things up. The photoluminescent products decrease the firefighter's rescue time by 45 seconds, which means they reach the victim 30% faster. I feel like it, uh, it definitely improved our work efficiency. We're heading down the stairwell, and it was, it was, it was like a runway. It was very visible. Uh, it allows us to get our job down quicker. Anytime we can do it quicker with visibility, we're much safer. So we were able to shave 45 seconds off our initial time, so, which is huge, huge in like a life or death situation when you have a firefighter down. Photoluminescent technology is fail-safe because it uses no batteries or electricity. Photoluminescent crystals are embedded in the special materials that can wrap the axe handle, highlight the trim on firefighter turnout gear, and show egress markings in stairwells. This material attracts ambient light and in the dark emit the light as a glow. The 1993 World Trade Center attack required six hours to evacuate the towers. After the 1993 bombing, the Port Authority passed a law requiring photoluminescent paint to be added to the stairwells of the World Trade Center buildings. With photoluminescent markings in dark stairwells, the 2001 evacuation took just over one hour. New York City building codes require new and existing buildings over 75 feet to have photoluminescent egress systems. Across the country, states have adopted the 2009 IBC codes for new construction and the IFC code for retrofitting older buildings. As of today, there are no standards for using beneficial photoluminescent firefighter gear. Firefighters continue to use turnout gear trimmed with retro reflective film. This material requires a light source, such as a flashlight, in order to be visible. Now firefighters can benefit from turnout gear and tool handles, air tank covers, and other equipment that uses photoluminescent safety material. Since photoluminescence utilizes stored energy to glow in the dark, firefighters now have numerous options for light to provide greater visual accountability to each other and their equipment for improved safety. Uh, from a safety standpoint, it's a vast improvement, um, being able to have positive accountability for your crew. Uh, tenfold, it increases our visibility. Uh, we're definitely more mobile. 
Just think if I'm on the side of a road, I want to be as, as visible as I can be. And being able to have positive accountability for your crew, and uh, it, like I said, it's, that's everything to us in our world. I would say the seconds that we gain uh, with this technology is just that, we're saving lives.